Wow, that's some way to sing a national anthem. We can see the passion in them, the vigour, the willingness to do anything for the match that lies in front of them. But not all the other country's players are doing so. Why Italy? Is it because they're from Italy? That could play to be one of the reasons, but it's not just that. In fact, it's not the reason at all. There's only one reason, and it's the national anthem of Italy. I mean, we all love our national anthem, we love singing it and respect it. But we don't end up doing this during our national anthem, do we? Like most of the great national anthems, Italy's was written in the shadow of war. It was written in 1847 during the first battles of the Italian unification. Surprisingly, it was made the national anthem by law only as recently as November 2005. The music was written by Michael Navarro, and it's a fairly typical Italian marching type and is generally regarded as poor by musicians and critics. But it's catchy. It's typically boisterous. It can become quite rowdy towards the end when the musical direction is growing and accelerating to the end. And everyone in Italy loves it. But some politicians in Italy have tried to get rid of it, saying no one understands the lyrics anyway. Eh, quite contrasting, isn't it? So, let's have a look at the lyrics. Brothers of Italy, Italy has awoken, bound Scipio's helmet tight upon her head. Where is victory? Let her bow down, because God created her as a slave of Rome. Let us unite, we are ready to die. We are ready to die, Italy has called. Let us unite, we are ready to die. We are ready to die, Italy has called. Yes, so, do the words make any sense? For some of the lyrics relate to some fairly obscure episodes of Italian history which don't have much meaning in the modern world. But overall, this is a simple battle cry. Made dramatic by obscure references and rambunctious music, Italy is ready to go to war to become free and will be as victorious as Rome was in ancient times. But no one really cares about the exact meaning of the words. It's a rousing song and despite some mutterings among politicians, it's hard to see anyone allowing it to be replaced and for us, we love seeing these players enjoying this song before their match. Obviously, they do enjoy it as they literally cry saying they are ready to die for the match ahead of them. They could relate to the war, which is the football match ahead of them. Wow, just literally, that gives me goosebumps. What about you guys? Do you love Italy's national anthem? Do mention in the comment section below and if you guys have had any suggestions on which video we should do next, suggest it in your comments as well. And if you did enjoy this video, smash that like button and subscribe for more. We hope to see you in our next video. Until then, goodbye and take care.